welcome to What You Need to Know About Connections, Orient Me. Whether you've had connections for a day or longer, like a week or a month or maybe a year or longer, you need to know the right way to get started every each day. So like any great tool, how you use it can make all the difference for the results you get from it. If you've had connections for a while, I'll really encourage you to take another look because we introduced Orient Me as the new homepage for connections and a lot has changed in the way it feels. So let's take a minute to see the best way to get started and how to check in throughout the day. First, let's see how you actually activate the new homepage. Here we are on the activity stream homepage that you're probably very familiar with. And as you can see on my user icon, I was able to click on it and select new homepage. After that's done, here is Orient Me. And you'll see that we have announcement banners up on top if configured. By default, you'll see top updates, but you can also switch over to latest updates, which is a chronological order, as opposed to the top updates, which uses intelligence to have those bubble up to the top that are most relevant to you. So each card represents an update. You can filter, like here, if I click on Add Mentions, I now see all the events that happened where I was Add Mentioned. So here I'm logged in as Paula, and I see Gail posted two updates uh, to me. Here are responses to events that I posted. So if people respond to things I've done, I can click on that third bubble on top and see what's up there. Another thing I see in this important to me bar, as we call it, is a bubble for a community. So if I want to get updates just from a community, I can click on the community or here on a person to see updates and events only related to either the person or the community. Uh, if that's still too many at the same time, I can add filters. Uh, for example, um, we leverage the tags here to show just updates related to the terms I am adding here. So this way I can drill down and drill down until I only get updates that are really relevant to what I'm looking for right now. So here we see that Gail invited me to join a community, the HR community, and I can accept it by clicking on the button here and I see there's another community, Health and Fitness, that I've been added to. And I accept that, I am now am a member of both of these communities. If I go back to Orient Me, I now would like to add a shortcut to the health um, community, the health and fitness community. So I click on the plus sign there, and now we see the icon for the health and fitness community in my important to me bar. So whenever I want to know what's going on in that community without actually going there, I'll click on the bubble in the important to me bar for that community, and I see all the relevant updates. This was another video in the series, What You Need to Know About Connections. Today we covered Orient Me. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.